how do I condition myself to go harder? I find myself like in a state of mind, like, oh, I have this deal coming in, I'll be fine. But I want to continue like going harder and harder. Like, how do I condition myself to do that? So glad you're asking this question. Let me take you guys back in time to my first deal, right? I came from like very limited means. Parents weren't rich. I was an entrepreneur. I did my first deal, but the business that I was in was losing money mm-hmm. every day. And so I make my first deal. I make $47,000 in change on my first deal. I didn't cash that check. I didn't cash that check until almost six months after that check was issued because I was so like, oh my God, look at this. And I, and I wanted to save it. And that's what I want you to do. How I want you to position mm-hmm. yourself is that that deal never happened. Okay. Look, you've got the confidence now. You know it's real, right? Yeah. You know the walls in your head prior to this, to this deal happening were like, is it going to, yes, I can see all these people getting success, but is it meant for me? Is yeah, it going to be for me? Yeah, it was definitely a scarcity mindset. And then just like always in my head, I'm like, it's, it's never going to happen. I just but have to, yeah. That was yeah. it, right? And so like you, that's, and that's you manifesting your own lack of results. Every time that that happens, anytime that you're in that frequency, the result mm-hmm. is what you're going to get more of. Miriam, yeah. you've, you've did something in the background there. Mm-hmm. And look, and maybe it's just been you connecting more in your faith. Maybe it's just been you connecting more in scripture. Maybe it's just been you connecting more into your own soul and into your own power. But Definitely. what you've been doing is what worked. Okay. Yeah. What you've been doing is what worked. And so how do you position yourself now that you've gotten this money, now that you've got this deal? save it. Like Mm -hmm. I told Heidi, if you have a charity that or something that you can give 10% of what you make to do it, especially in this time right now, when you have just $7,000 giving away 700 of it's going to be really freaking hard. No, it's actually like, if it's like somebody in need, I'm I'm glad to give away because like, I've been following a lot of like, Instagram videos of like people going into like foreign countries, like giving back. I'm like, I want to do that. That's like one of my dreams. Like I want to do that. So find a way to bless somebody with $700. Okay. Okay. Give the 10% away and then save every dang else dime of it. The next thing that you're going to do is what did you do to get this deal under contract? You connected to a wholesaler. Well, I was just working like on privy. It was on privy and then I connected to the agent and it went from there. Okay, so it's another privy deal. So again, yeah, make sure that you're staying consistent with your privy every morning, right? Check privy mm-hmm. every single day. In fact, double down and check privy twice a day, right? Because yeah. privy taps into the MLS and it's real time. Check privy tight twice a day. And then the next thing that you should do, Miriam, is spend the rest of your hours doing agent outreach. You did a good job connecting with to, yeah. the, to the realtor. And now you've got your outlet. Chris and Elena, they did a great job for you out there, right? You can trust that they're going to get the deals done for you. Yeah, definitely. And then with that, I was like having the thoughts like not going to happen. Like something is going to fail. Oh, I know. Because you sent me a DM. And even in your DM, you were like, you were almost second guessing it. And I I responded to you like, Miriam. Yeah. It's (laughs) don't worry about it. Okay. Mm -hmm. Like this deal's not closing to the 18th. It's like, it's totally normal that they haven't reached out to the hard money lender yet. Like it's all good. It's all good. It's all good. But this is the thing right now, double down on the, on the work that you've been doing on yourself and then continue Mm -hmm. agent outreach, continue agent outreach, just go ham on it.